After we did our installation for Laravel and development, we are now going to prepare our migrations and models. But first, uh, I'm going to change the database to MySQL. I wanted to use MySQL, not SQLite. So I'm going to use MySQL. And I should uncomment this. I guess this should be a password. So I have my SQL already installed on my machine. And I guess this is the password for localhost. And maybe we add database. We can call it div talks. Right. And uh, I'm going to use my SQL. Workbench. I like this application. Yeah, this is the connection. I'm going to add a new schema. Yes. Uh, new stocks. I'm going to stick with the defaults. All right. Yes, please. So I'm going to do our mig migrate again. We are this migrate fresh the slash seed. Migrate is not correct. Yeah, let's uh, check our database now. So our dev talks. Let's uh, yes, let's open it, and we have some tables. We have table users. So our user. I think we lost our user. All right, if we do, no. so we the the uh, the old user we created for filament is lost. So I think we are going to add it again. by this command yes admin admin at admin.com all right let's try again yes and let's check our database Yes, it, it's been added here. Now let's add our models and migrations. I'm going to add just two tables. I'm going to start very simple. Which we are tested. Big model category dash M for migration. So yeah, it, uh, it is created to files, a category, model, and our migration. And I'll add also most table. So yeah, let's uh, check our migrations. I'm going to add uh, title, table, string, title. And also, I'm going to add description to be, I'm going to add the slug first, string, slug, yes. And yeah, I'm going to add 
description in case we we want to add it uh, for SEO for beta tags. So this could be description. Yes, dollable. Yeah, this could be index as well. If we wanted to search by it, we should make it as index. Yeah, I think we don't uh, need anything else here. I'm going to save and I'm going to to copy same data it will be here and uh, and the table long text should be should be body all right and uh, I think we should add also table string some deal. Well, I think we maybe add a boolean. for active or not because yeah if we want to to deactivate uh, a must without uh, removing it this might be useful so i think uh, that's it right i think we don't need anything else and let's go to our models yeah let's migrate should we are this migrate everything is good and now let's add our relations so the category should have multiple we should have should use fillable first protected fillable equals yeah what we have the title slug description title slug description And we should add public function posts. So the category should have multiple posts or this has many, right? Most class. Return yeah this auto increment is brilliant to be honest yeah this should has yeah and we imported it as well yeah that's fine we are going to the the post uh, uh, model we will add title, slug description, thumbnail. All right. And uh, body active. What else? Yeah, that's it. And we should add this method public function category. So our our must should be logged to one category. 
So it is just one too many relation. We turn this belongs to category class, right? We have a customer, we have this is here, and the return type will be belongs to. Yeah, I think that's fine. And uh, yeah, that's so good for. We might add uh, user ID here in case someone else is uh, contributing to this blog. But for now, I think it is. Uh, not necessary so yeah I think uh, we are good for now no errors yeah uh, that's it for this video and uh, see you in the next video bye